<clears throat> so, when I was about ooh, between the ages of seven and four, I would think, I was probably older, I don't remember, somewhere in there, I went over to my friend Jeff's house, me and my older brother and my older sister, and we would always go over there, we'd hang out, um, and one day, uh, Jeff's mom was like, hey, you guys want to um, play with the gardening tools? I'm like, yeah, that just sounds like a great idea. I mean, gardening tools? For kids, like, between the ages of 4 and 10? Isn't that genius? She's helping us get out all the tools, right? They're like little kid tools. However, they do have wood and metal on them. So she's getting out the shovel, getting out the rake, and getting out the hose. There was actually two hose. One was plastic and one was metal. And she gave me the plastic one, and I was like, not having it. I am not having it, okay? This is not my hoe. Uh, my friend Jeff, he got the metal one. And I was like, dude, that is my hoe. Don't touch my hoe, okay? He, I walk up to him, and I'm like, hey, you know, be the four-year-old me. I was like, hey, I, I want the hoe. And he's just like, no, it's, it's mine. It's my hoe. It's my house. It's my hoe. This, this is where it all goes wrong, okay? So we start fighting over the hoe. He grabs one side, I grab the other, and we're just having a tug of war, going all at it with the hoe. I'm, however, holding the side without the, the hoe's face. I'm pulling, and he gets fed up, and he just, let's go! He let go of the hoe. And, uh, worst thing that could have been done. As I'm pulling the hoe, and he lets go, it comes up, and it gets me right in the forehead. After that, I have no idea what happened, but I assume there was blood, because to this day, I still have a scar on my forehead, and it's most likely not from Voldemort. Although it may sometimes look like the shape of a lightning bolt, in some lights, and when you can't see it. So, learn your lesson while you're young. Go play with hoes.